Avast there! September 19th, we talk like a pirate day. So what myself and me first mates are gonna be doing for your pleasure is to educate you on the proper verbiage and vernacular that comes with being a buccaneer. We both have sailed the seas from England to the Caribbean, and we've learned all the turns of phrase to make us sound like a true gentleman of fortune. So let's come about and dive right in. Shiver me timbers. Tis an important way to express surprise or amazement at something or someone. Timbers refers to the boards that a sailing ship is built out of. When we're caught up in a storm at sea, the ship is pounded with such force that we can feel her timbers shivering beneath us. If I'm going to the local farmer's market, and they're all out of my favorite organic lip balm, I might say, Shiver me timbers! There be no chapstick for this here voyage! One of the things us pirates live for is those shiny pieces of eight. You see, pieces of eight are silver coins minted by the Spaniards that can be broken up into eight smaller pieces. For example, Yesterday I was talking to me mates, and I got to thinking about how much I'd like me a nice, juicy cheeseburger. So I asked me mate if he'd lend me some pieces of eight, and he'd spend them all on milkshakes. One of the things you're sure to always find on a pirate ship is rats. We calls them bilge rats on account of the bilge being the lowest part of the ship. When we're mighty desperate, we've even been known to eat them rats on account of needing to survive. Bilge rat can also refer to someone that works way down below on a ship, although usually we mean it as an insult. You blinkin' bilge rat! Come back here with my trousers, or I'm going to send your sorry hinder down to Davy Jones's locker! You filthy Beldrad, come back here with my bird, or I'm going to send your sorry hide down to Davy Jones' locker! Why are you running off with so many of my things? Speaking of Davy Jones' locker, let me tell you of old Davy. He were a right fearsome sailor, what some said never captured a ship but to sink her. And Davy Jones' locker be the watery grave where all these sunken ships went after they were destroyed. Hand over all the booty I've got on this here ship. If and you don't give it over right and smart like, we'll take them cannons and send you on down to Davy Jones's locker. Arr. Well, there you has it. There be some fine piratey vocabulary that is needed all proper like for your Talk Like a Pirate Day celebrations. And if you can't get enough of everything to do with pirates sailing the high seas, come meet the crew of How Much More Productions. They'll be hoisting the Jolly Roger on Treasure Island, November 4th at Christ the King Church in Coeur d'Alene. Go ahead and reel in some desserts and watch an authentic radio production come to life with live holy sound effects. An attempt to dazzle even Captain Flint himself. We're hoping to see you all there.